What's up everybody and welcome back. This is Final Hydra and today we're playing some more of The Evil Within 2. This spooky scary game filled with weird horrors, abominations, and other things of that nature that I don't like. But we're gonna go out there and we're gonna kill them. Because that's, that's what you do with horrors and abominations. You go out there and you just goddamn kill them. Hold on, can I check my health? What's my health at? You know what? Is this ready? Can I, can I drink this yet? I mean, look at how close that is. I would, like, can I just have half a cup of coffee? No, it's got to be the full pot. Damn. This guy is intense. Give me the coffee. Give it to me. I feel like I'm literally, you know what? Screw it. I don't need full health. Who needs full health to do anything in this game, right? Not me. Every time I leave and the camera does, like, that weird thing there, I, I'm not going to lie. I get super scared and I totally just feel like I'm about to get destroyed. Um, we're gonna go here and do the woman's voice, then do the the girl's voice. I said that we were definitely gonna get some story stuff done this episode, and I wasn't lying, guys. We're just might be doing it in a weird order. All right. Oh. Oh. Can I? Oh, forgot I had the axe. Well, you know what? Easy come, easy go. I say that's uh, that's what I'm telling you, folks. Who keeps gunpowder under their car? People in this god awful. Oh, shit. Oh, man. That area is not looking friendly. Whoa, we. One, two, three, four, five, six. I think I. Seven, eight. Oh, sh there's another one right there. I think that's a ninth one. Plus that weird thing that I don't even know if it can die. Totally F that and everything it stands for. We're not dealing with that right now, folks. Just no whoa we F that. Can I get in here? I kind of figured you're trying to... I just want to point out that that is an outward swinging door and this genius just tried to push it. Just saying. Like, I don't want to... Yeah, maybe it is locked. It's just... Can I knock you down? We're going to test out the melee right now. We're just going to keep beating this... No, you're not. No, you're not. No, you're not. You're not going to do that. Get the hell off me. I pushed you through a fence. Uh, that's how much I didn't want that. Not going to lie. This is super hard to aim up close. Stomper. Stomp her out. All right, don't need to. I was totally ready to do it, though. Okay, so... Can I get to that menu? How do I get to that menu? Nope, not that. Is this... Let's reload. There it is. The semi-automatic handgun, I'm going to go with just the regular version of it. Because firing that close... I don't know. The laser sight, I felt, made it... Have I been here before? Dude, there's an obvious interior to this building. I, I feel like I should be able to get inside there. Anywho, let's not get distracted, folks. We're going to have one of these. Good old uh, adrenaline shot. That, you know, makes you, makes you regular. All right, I see it. I see it. Harpoon it. When it's sitting that still, and I can get a nice... Oh, come on. That looks like it... Oh, just missed her goddamn head. Well, that didn't. Got you again. All right, come on, lady. Please, oh god, no. I'm scared, I'm scared, and I'm, I'm firing blindly here. In, okay. Things aren't going well here, folks. Lady, how about you get the hell off me, alright? Alright, listen, I don't know you, I don't like you. You're laying on the ground now. Oh, man. Alright, my, my dude's not going well. Medical kit time, bro. Alright. Uh, kind of feel like that was BS that literally the second I had the, uh, the bow pulled back, 
the uh, character knew to then just start wiling out. Oh, I have two bullets. Oh. Man, it's very obvious. No, I think he's just dead. I'll take just dead. You could totally just stay there, dude. You don't even have to get up. Don't worry about it. Oh, got some more stuff. Take that. Wonder what the point of this is. It's locked on that side, but the front door is wide open. Oh, I know where we are. I know where that is. Nope, F that. All right, so we're kind of out of bullets. Scale of 1 to 10, how bad is that? Uh, really bad most of the time. All right, what you got, buddy? This is the dude who gives me the, the better pouch for handgun rounds, I'm pretty sure. Yep, cool, pouch upgrade, 32. Perfect. Uh, oh, and it gave me... Uh, gave, oh, I thought it gave me some ammo as well. Got that dude wiling out over there. This house. Is this where the woman's voice was? It is. Alright, we're going to take a hot second. I don't really have any bullets to deal with anything that might be in there. Oh, can I break this? Uh, it looked like one of those, you know, the key statues, potentially. We're going to take a hot skip over here real quick. We're just going to check the street out. Come on. I always leave bullets in the trash can for uh, a kindly neighborhood uh, zombie exterminator dude. But that's because I'm nice. All right, I'm finding a lot of weapon parts. I'm fine with that. I mostly wanted to sneak up on that guy and actually get the stealth kill, but uh, apparently now he's just wiling out. On the car. Look at him. He's just going crazy. I just wanted to get these guys out of here while I had like a hot second, you know, to do it. Yep, get in the bush. Get in the bush. It's okay. Shh. We're going to get them. We're going to get right up behind these idiots. And we're going to get them. Get off that car! That ain't your car! Alright, now he takes a little nap. Takes a little nap. See, now how about that? How about that lady? Hey, hey lady. I, I don't know. Hey, you want to come over here? Come on, come on over. You heard that. Everybody on this block heard that. Now come here. I'm going to equip this, not because I want to use it, but just in case. Just in case. I don't got the handgun rounds to really play that game too well. Gotcha. <laughs> mm. Oh, I'm on fire. Stealth killing them, probably not what, the, what I should be doing there, I guess, is uh, what the game is trying to tell me there. Alright. We dealt with that. We dealt with all that heebity jeebity mumbo jumbo. Now, I was hoping there was a workbench nearby, but I could see that there is not. Pick up some of these on the way back. Well, you know, I've got the shotgun. I've got the sniper rifle. If I really need to bust it out melee range, you know, I'm confident that I'd at least be able to hit what I need to. The shotgun should deal with anything that's in here. So let's check out this lady's voice. Hey, lady. Oh, you know what? My light was on. Now I know why that lady was wiling out while I was aiming at her. What the hell is this? Oh, just, just bottles in a purse, man. She was stocking up on some alcohol. Hey, yeah.
Always take a nice medical syringe. Were you what I was coming here for? All right. Yeah, this is gonna go bad. I've got bullets in my gun. This is gonna not go well. Where is she? Hey, lady, you in here? What is this? Dear diary, today a ghost killed me. What's happening? I don't like it. Woman's journal, the fire. Final entry of this diary, penned in an unsteady hand. There is something in this house with me. I can't see it, but I sense its presence. I don't think I want to see it. I can hear those horrible things outside. They're everywhere. I'm afraid to go, but I'm afraid to stay in here, too. I'm shivering, but it's not from fear. Why did it get so cold? It's freezing. Oh, God, no. Please be bullets. Please be bullets. Come on, just give me some bullets. I guess if this lady had bullets, she would have used them, you know? That would have been... Yeah, that would have been too easy, wouldn't it have? Come on, I'm gonna go full supernatural on this thing. I got a shotgun filled with rock salt. I'm ready. Oh, no. Uh Oh no. Oh Jesus. Uh what do I do? What do I do? It's not even moving. What the fuck is happening? Yeah, I'm I'm with you, bro. What is this? Is it saying my name? There are bottles it's everywhere. Me. I gotta get out of here. I think it's blind. Oh God. I guess this is where I die. Dang it, come on. Damn it. <laughs> Alright, so uh, my initial thought on it being blind is uh, not true. We figured that out very quickly there because it honed right in on me. Very slowly, but it did. Um, should I shot it? Probably not. The thing obviously can move through surfaces and like the environment, so... Probably should not shoot it. What's happening here? Come on, load in game. Where am I? Am I in that room again? Oh God. What the fuck is happening? All right, I'm ready for you, lady. I'm just gonna take off and run. Remember, there was a door at the end there that I saw at the very uh, last second. Maybe it doesn't know where I am? I have no idea. I need to find a key card though. That's very obvious. Okay. The doors that it came in definitely don't even look functioning they're definitely not that door sadly is but that's where the thing went so am I going to walk through the door and die be some way to get out of here I could see it through the window
Nothing says bad ideas like kicking doors right now. Oh my god, like the song it's singing is so creepy. Key card. Son of a... Okay, alright. Um, it moves through walls. This might get me out of here. Got it. All right. Where's it going? Where's it going? It's going back through the wall. Damn it, it knows I have the card. It's cheating. There are bottles all over the ground, and I'm guessing that if I kick those, it kind of alerts it to where I am. I don't want to throw a bottle because I don't know if that's actually helping, making things worse. Please use the key card faster, dude. No! Oh, God. Not fair. This isn't fair. I got through the door. This isn't fair. I did what I had to do. Okay, we're back. Pull out your gun. Pull out something. Anything. Be ready. Just imagine that. No. That was... What was that thing? Oh, I don't like this. Jesus. Relic from a pre... Okay. Wow, that's like the second one of those I've found yet. Huh, I don't even have this shotgun equipped anymore. I came out with a bottle up like, Don't make me throw this! Who's out there? Lady's still dead. Do I need any more bottles, or... Yeah, I was going to say, I'm probably still full from the reload. That was uh, really unnerving there at the very end as it kept saying my name and floating towards me and my guys just gingerly opening doors like it's, uh, yeah, it's fine, whatever. Got all the time in the world. I'm trying to, you know, is this a mahogany door? It's nice. Like, push the damn thing. Get the hell out that door. I would have... I would have been like sliding that key card and like shoulder button that door all at the same time. Would have looked like I've I've been using that key card and using that door for like 37 years, man. That would have looked so familiar to me. Probably wouldn't have looked familiar. I would have looked so panicked, just like smashing my face against it, like just get this goddamn door open. If I could just get this goddamn door open, everything would be so much better. All right, we're coming back here one because uh, I want to make some more bullets. And uh, two, can't hurt to just drop off at the safe house before we head up to go investigate the woman's voice. So we're going to save. You know what, let's make the bullets first. Uh, now, is there... Well, there's some coffee. Might as well have some coffee. Can't hurt. Now, is there a workbench actually in the safe house, or do I have to go back to, you know, my little office room? Glug, 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 glug. Perfect. Um, yeah, I don't think there is one here. I have to, yeah, I have to go back to the room. Which is fine, which is totally cool. We'll do that. We'll go back to the room real quick. Um, it seems to load almost instantly, which is exactly what I want. And let's just make some bullets. Crafting. Handgun bullets. 21. Yes, please. Um, and we can always make some more harpoons. Can't hurt. Well, I guess it could hurt, but not me. It's not hurting me. I have 75 gun parts. I don't think there's anything worth only 75 gun parts. Apparently, this is worth uh, exactly 75 gun parts. Oh, never mind. It was a lot less than that. My bad. 
I did not understand. Increase the strength. I might actually want to do that. Just because, you know, I do like using the harpoon bolts a lot. I just, like before, I, just, I don't feel like they do a lot of damage. I get people in the neck and they're just like, ah, whatever. They walk it off. They keep coming at me. I get scared. It's like, I did my part. I hit you with it. Now, do I know this password yet? Yeah, still need Looks the like passcode for that. Some sort of password. Let's just save. I like how we could beat that ghost without needing any bullets, though. That's, uh, I just want to see. Can I open this drawer? Please be gunpowder. Nothing? All right. That's unacceptable, but I guess we can try to deal with it like we do all the other things that make us sad in this game. All right. So let's go investigate that girl's voice and forward this plot. Coffee for me. Hold on. Oh my god, of course. Of course her voice is up there past all the damn gobbledygook monsters. It's in the pit stop. Can I walk through this? Totally can. That's where the other one was, right? Yep, there's one right over there. Alright, come on, buddy. What do you got? Some gunpowder? I'll take it. Mostly because you can't stop me from taking it. Because you're dead. Unless you want to turn into a gobbledygook. That's what I'm calling them now. That's the new word. Gobbledygook monsters. Does it make sense? No. But is it fun to say? Yes. If you don't believe me, try saying it a few times. You'll you'll fall in love with it quickly. It's the gobbledygook monsters. Alright, what do we got? Oh, is that... Oh, it's a med kit. Totally fine with that. Because I used the other one after uh, that lady with the knife just kept coming. The white witch... All right, we've pretty much just bypassed that whole area, which is totally fine by me. Still got that thing roaming around down there. Not a fan. But we're getting very close to the voice. Oh, is that her right there? Something down there just exploded. Tune, tune, tune. What the? Little hands. Are All right. Lilies? I don't know. How many other children are in here? That's the real question we have to ask. Open. Look forward, buddy. Come on. Lily, are you here? It's Dad. Oh, where did she go? Look for the little. Up oh, there's the little feetses. All right. All right. Lily. The door just turned yellow. Okay. It's okay. It's me. It's not gonna be Lily. It's gonna be something horrible. Oh, Damn here it. we go. All right, calm down. How do I get in there? I love how it literally shows it to you. Like, I don't want you to think too hard about this. Just move that very hard, heavy desk, and crawl. Oh God. Oh, I was waiting for a monster to grab my arms and like pull me through. I didn't want to watch it happen. It's Lily's doll. She's been here. Oh. Yep, deadbolt. Good kid. Good kid. Smart kid, smart kid, right out the window. Lily, oh my God, she's in trouble. 
someone is chasing her. I should check out around back. See where that window comes out. I just want to say this child scaled this and got out that window without knocking over anything. That's that's some uh, that's some nimble climbing right there. Now I haven't been in this diner in the real world. I've only been inside of it inside the little fake world that we were just in. Is this thing making me coffee? Garbage. So I'm expecting. there to be something I just heard something that literally sounded like somebody breathing really hard while sleeping it was like a I just want to say I heard that I want to try to knock them blinds aside see what's going on out there before I open this door into scariness okay If I said I was a little surprised that there wasn't something literally waiting outside the door for me, uh, I am. I'm very surprised. There's a flashlight. All right, Lily. Where did you run off to? Oh. Take that flashlight, girl. I mean, dude, take that damn flashlight. I can't move right now. What the? Another signal. Oh, I've been there. I'm coming, sweetheart. Just hang in there. Can I take that flashlight? I just—I feel like that's totally just a waste of a useful supply of some kind. Just leaving a fully powered flashlight just like in a dumpster on just seems dumb. We could totally just take that. All right, so. We've now got a new waypoint to keep chasing Wi uh, Lily. Willy. We're chasing Willy. Good old Willy from The Simpsons, you know. Willy the Groundskeeper. Pretty much my favorite character on The Simpsons. Alright. I'm coming, Lily. I'm coming, Willy! Keep your Scottish beard on. We're on the way. Dun 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 dun. Running very haphazardly through an open field. Dun, 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 dun. Gonna get spotted. Wait, where the? Whoa, are the monsters all gone? Look, it's just that one dude, and he's coming right for me, like he knows where I am. She's looking right at me. If I sit right here, it'll come back. We're going to stab it in the face. I mostly want to investigate the pile of bodies again because that was a big thing down there. Yeah, look, that one monster is totally gone wherever wherever it decided to toddle off to. You get the knife ready, bro. Don't look at me. Don't you look at me. I said, don't you look at me. Shit. Just threw a Molotov at me. I just want to say this monster is uh, smarter than I would. Oh my god, he's got a whole bunch. How many of those you got, pal? Let's not touch me, alright? I never reloaded. I'm gonna get him in the head as soon as he's. Please stop. Please be dead. Huh, I'm not doing very well today with the gun, guys. Uh, if that's not dead obvious, I'm. I'm doing extremely badly while firing. I'm just, I don't know, don't know what it is. I'm just, maybe I'm just scared today. I'm just, I'm not on point. All right, more piles of bodies. Now, my guy even said that they're piling bodies up. Why? Why are they doing that? We're not sure yet. What's going on over there? That's a wrecked car. That's another one of them, but he's like way over there. I'm not going to go out of my way for that. <gasps> there you go. Zokni, I found that key for you. 
Third row, three over. I saw it in the comments. It's happening. All right, now, where am I going? Before I... Other side of the town. Now, thankfully, I think I cleared most of this out. Already. I don't remember this truck being open. I feel like I would have came in here and gotten these parts, but maybe not. I am very nervous at times. How close are we? Oh, we are totally on point. All right, right here. Let's try this again. I got it. I'm here. I'm here. Echo of my daughter. I don't like how it has control of the camera. There it is. Investigate. What do we got? What is this? Is that her? I just saw her go the other way, though. This is weird. Lily, how are you? She's running so haphazardly. A few days old. Hope it's not Lily's. Oh, I can totally... Wait a minute. Where am I? Oh my god, I'm in that... I was going to say, I have no idea where it is. I'm just waiting for the button prompt. I just kept hitting A while I was standing there. I was like, I'll eventually get it, right? He'll eventually just... He'll, he'll feed himself to me like a dummy. Yeah, we're right nearby. Can I get to the other bush before I am noticed? 50-50. There is this large bush blocking us. I got him. I got him. Yeah, kidney. Back of the skull. That's what I do. Shush. Totally silent. Nobody heard that, I hope. Nobody heard the thing go rrr, rrr, as I was stabbing it in the back of the head. Who listens to monsters? Nobody. They're not even people. Now, I know I got a couple more weapon parts. 60. Uh, what I wanted to see really quick is can I upgrade the power on just these for 60? Perfect. Yeah, just I want the the harpoons to just do some more damage because I do use them a lot. Uh, when I real, and when I use them, not for nothing, I'm really expecting it. I'm firing a harpoon. I want the damn thing to die in one hit. Now, you know, I understand that that is not always, you know, a guarantee in a game like this in a in a horror survival kind of loot it, loot it, build it, shoot it game, but um. You know, it's a goddamn harpoon. The thing's like a foot long. I'm hitting you in the side of the head with it. You should be going down. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying here. All right, let's find this damn daughter signal. Up, oh, got it. Thankfully, I cleared all this out already. See, now, can you imagine if I didn't clear out all these dudes? This would be much harder to do. So maybe uh, those episodes in between here and there where I did that, all for the better good. Thank God. Thank God for what? That you found her again, or...? I... I don't understand why that resonance keeps happening like this. Like, I watch it. It looks like she stopped here to hide. Perfect. Let's... She must be in that warehouse. Smart girl. Lots That's why. See, and we already cleared this out. That's why that board in the last episode, I was unable to knock it over. It was, it was, like I said, it was a level gate, basically, but without being an actual level gate. It was just meant. Now, is this guy going to stagger out again? Oh, sh shit. Shit. I'm scared. Let 
Now we've already been here. Lily, it came from upstairs. Yep, not actually breakable. You need to. She probably crawled through here. Got to get through. Yeah, come on, use that dad strength. Your daughter's in trouble. Just go nuts. Adrenaline's pumping. You're, you're feeling it. Resourceful little girl. She's gonna be okay. I just gotta. That's a hand. Her. That's a leg. Nothing that's going on in this place is uh, acceptable. First things first, pick up some gun parts. My daughter's in trouble, but that was like two days old, so. Hey, buddy. Come on. Yeah, I was going to say, let's just be smart here. All right, now I know she's upstairs. Where did he go? I want to explore this before I go up because, you know, I just want to. Handgun bullets. I like how he punched that stuff, and then it just faded away. Why don't you look in the corner there for a second, Bubba? I don't know if I can actually stealth take the, down this guy. Oh, thank God. Yeah, he's totally dead. Thanks for the free axe. Totally needed that. See, now this thing might be useful. In oh, 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 oh. Maybe this is going to be useful in my upstairs escapades now. I got handgun bullets. I got an axe. They're gearing me up. They're very subtly gearing me up for something, you know? Lily? They gave me a workbench. Oh, man, no. This is brutal. They gave me a workbench and health supplies. I guess just make one of those. Why not? Do I need to heal at all? How much... What weapon parts do I got? I do need to heal, actually. So let me do that. And then I'll take that medical syringe that's just chilling there for me. Dude, they're like trying to top you off. They're giving you all these supplies right now. Oh, no. Anybody who's ever played video games knows that for a fact that when the game starts giving you supplies in like great quantities and there's like a, all of a sudden like a there's like an auto save or a save point Another like doll. But where's Lily? Let's not even look at the doll. Don't even look at it. Is my shotgun loaded? This is what I need to know. Is it fully loaded? Yes, it is. Uh, that's loaded. I wish you would tell me, how many gun parts do I have right now? Like, that's what I just want to know. Components, key items. I was going to go back and try to, like, make it so I could put one extra shell in the shotgun. Um, but alright, here we go. Smart. It's that goddamn guy with the camera. Get away from my daughter, you weirdo. Get out of here. Get out of here. Yeah, you take my advice. Get out of here before I F you up. It's going to happen to you. Mess with my daughter, you're going to die. Son of a him. The murderer with the camera. 
And the son of a bitch has my little girl. I was so close. Damn it! Calm down. Think. I gotta save her. No we'll more signals coming into this communicator. I need to find another way. O'Neill. Not sure I can trust him. But he wants out of here as bad as I want to find Lily. O'Neill, it's Sebastian. Can you hear me? Maybe it'll work better outside. Okay, cool. Let's take this. Now look, there's like a whole nother area over there that I can get to. But first, because I was literally just inquiring about it. How many gun parts I got right now? I know I keep finding them. 20. I doubt that's enough to... Yeah, it needs one of these. You know what? Why not? I know that that's probably silly to upgrade it like that and not go for firepower, but, you know, having extra bullets in it is always good, too. Uh, and I'm sure I'll find more high-grade weapon parts. I mean, we're only so far into the game. See him. I was going to hit him with a bottle. I don't know why I thought that was going to do it. Well, here I am. Here we go. You see how this zooms in a little harder? Alright, let's just have a look. I see something there. Why do I have a feeling it's going to be O'Neal? Doesn't look like O'Neill, just looks like some dude. What's happening to you? Can you reset so I can see how you how it starts? I guess I'm not seeing a bullet, so I'm guessing it's just a slash to the throat with a knife. Yeah, he just looks like some normal dude. Alright, moving along. Smile for me. You smile for me, you. There you are. But where's Lily? Can't let him get away again. Okay, he opened the door for me. Fine. I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna go back out. I know we're 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 hot on the trail, but listen, if we don't go up here, we probably never will. Let's let's be honest with each other. I'll forget. And it'll never happen. And there are potentially supplies out there through that door. Like, look, you can only access it from, like, here. You couldn't even get to it from over there. I guess not. I, I totally just wasted our time and bungled. Alright, it's fine. Can I jump down? Nope. Alright. Alright, that's fine. We're, we're right back on Lily's trail then. That's all it is. That guy's got a missing leg. Open the door, buddy. Come on. All right, Lily. Dad's coming somehow. I'm just I'm tired. I'm a little old. Just We're on the way. I totally shot him in the back of the head, though. A little teleporting cheater. Hey! You! The girl! Where is she? Tell me! What? That's super weird. Oh no. Fuck. Ah. 
Okay, we're gonna see what happens. We're gonna go back inside because you know what? There's one behind me somewhere. No time to fully reload, just... I think those are dead. I think it's dead. Okay. Okay. What in... Shit, lost him again. Hope I can reach O'Neal this time. I... I'm tempted to go back for those shotgun rounds we left upstairs. Sebastian. You're still alive? I mean... You're still alive. Good. Were you able to locate the core? No. But I know who has her. And he's got powers like nothing else in here. But I lost him. I think I can help you out with that. I picked up a frequency I've never seen before. It's coming from City Hall. Great. Where's that? Look up. Do you see a building with a big clock tower? Yeah. That's it. How in the hell am I supposed to get up there? It's a bit complex. Come back here, I can explain. Right. I'm on my way. A bit complex. Dude, wait a minute. I'm just picking stuff up. What's happening here? Oh, goody. Alright, I'm actually going to run back up for those shotgun shells, but I'm going to edit this out. So I'll see you guys in like three seconds. Alrighty. Now, we got some more shotgun shells. My health is a little low from those things hitting me. We'll do that. We'll just get ourselves, you know, topped off, we'll say. What's the significance of pulling that again? Weird. Okay, so, where's that big eye in the sky? Is that thing still up there? That thing was super weird. That's where we gotta go. O'Neill's supposedly gonna help us get there. I don't want to sound like I doubt O'Neill, but I doubt O'Neill. Alright, I'm hearing something out here. Now, it did show us that the world seems to have been re-inhabited by more of the gobbledygook monsters everywhere. Man, I use this area constantly. How about no? How about no? How about look, I'm gone, you don't know where I am. Right in the head. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Reload. So maybe that little bit of a damage increase is what I needed on this thing. Or that was just like literally the best shot I've ever taken with it. I mean, she was very gracious. She stood there and let me line that up. <laughs> she was a gracious idiot. Alright, now O'Neill is directly across the street. All right. All right, not so bad getting here. There was just one monster that wasn't there before. Do you see that like way down there like as I was turning? You see that circle? Is something over there for me to get? Like that's super weird. Hmm. 
I guess we'll investigate under here while we're here, right? More gunpowder, never bad. It's weird. I think every time I've looked under a, a car in the game, I've gotten gunpowder. Not that I really want to complain. I mean, I love gunpowder. It helps me make more bullets. I just think that that's odd that every car in the game has gunpowder underneath it. Like, I'm wondering, at this point, should I just assume if a car has an investigate underneath it, that means free gunpowder time? All right. First things first, we did get that key now, didn't we? And I did promise anybody who said in the chat which chest they wanted unlocked, I would unlock them. So let's see if uh, you picked a good one there. Three, row three, three across. Back again, detective? Always. Always. Let's have a look at these lockers. All right. One, two, three. One, two, three across, right? Three down, three across. Let's have a look. What do we got? Ooh! Shotgun shells. Are there still more in there that I can't pick up? That's really good. I'm really excited because now I've got some shotgun shells that if I need in a pinch, I know they're in that locker here. Thank you. I mean, next, it, same goes for, this ep for the next episode. If you guys see something in there... Um, or you want to pick like an area by all means let me know where you want me to pick and I will pick it when it comes to it now We definitely don't have enough for that That's what I would like This increases my melee damage I don't think I care too much about athleticism Now what does this do your footsteps produce even less noise making enemies even slower to investigate okay? What is this? Special ability which allows you to quickly close to an enemy for a chance to sneak kill. Chance. I don't like that. Ooh, bottles and inventory will be used to break free from somebody's grab attack. I like that perfectly. Perfect. They don't even need to be equipped, it said. We'll do that. Health up. What's this? Defiance. If your attack would have just barely done enough damage to kill you, you'll grit your teeth and bear it remaining alive with a small amount of health. That I need to get. Totally need to get that. What's this? Vitality 1. Total health recovered. Oh, that's pretty good too. We only have 3, so I guess we're going to have to wait for that stuff. Is there anything I can talk that to this lady for? I see. And in need of some improvements. You're getting closer to what you seek. I feel it. Well, thank My you. Daughter. She's somewhere inside this place. Yes, and you're determined. I can sense a change in you. Let's change you further. Give you the tools you need to find her. Perfect. Thanks. Thanks for your uh, your help as always, uh, crazy lady. Oh, the cat's meow, and I can hear it. The cat's a meow. I know, I've got a new, uh, I've got another thing here. Let's have a look at it. Still have not seen anybody else from that group as far as I know, but let's check out what we got here. Yes, happy family. Uh, tragic fire kills, kills child and nanny. What a shame. I like this cat. This cat is uh, very cute. I would totally pet this cat a lot more. Let me check this out. I don't think we've added anything. Nope, it all literally looks the same. I have like this horrible feeling like O'Neill is going to be totally dead. But, you know, screw O'Neill, right? Alright, O'Neill. What do you got for me? Hopefully a pot of coffee, my friend. O'Neill, you're not dead. What a surprise and a half. And a, wow, you've got a lot of stuff here for me. Take that. Take the gunpowder. I actually don't need that shotgun ammo, even though I really want it. Let's just do some upgrades before we talk to O'Neill, because that'll probably be, if I had to guess, what do we got, 40 weapon parts? 120 to increase the capacity on that. How about for the shoddy? 80. We're getting there. We're getting there. We've done firepower. We've done the ammo capacity on this. Uh, on this here... That requires 120. Whew. That's a lot. This will only require 25 to increase its range, though. Hmm. 
Maybe we do it. Yeah, just increase the range a little bit. Can't hurt, right? Crafting. All right, we have plenty of bullets that we can make. Let's do that. Make some more harpoons. Always good to have extra harpoons. Make another medical syringe. I'm not going to make another smoke bolt. I haven't even found the use for one just yet. And let's just have a cup of joe. I'm going to have some too. I'm not going to drink a whole gallon at a time like my, uh, like my friend here in the game. That's a little barbaric in my opinion. But hey, I like to enjoy my cup. All right, let's let's see what O'Neill's got for us. You made it here, okay? Not sure if "okay" is the right word, but yeah, I made it. Now, tell me how to get to City Hall. Union was built with a sort of backstage area, so Mobius operatives could observe the test subjects in secret. Most of these passageways are still intact enough to bypass the fissures in Union. Oh. But chunks of the city are floating in the air. How are their tunnels? They're passageways, not tunnels. When you go in and out of them, you're basically phase shifting. We call it the marrow. It exists in a layer separate from what you see. That doesn't make any sense. Fortunately for you, it doesn't have to make sense. It just has to work. Fact. But it's a maze down there. If you take the wrong path, you could end up on the other side of town. Where's this marrow that gets me to City Hall? And who comes up with these ridiculous names? I'll mark the location of the port. It's in the North Safe House. Looks like a regular computer, but it's not. I'll give you the. We've already found that. Activated. Once you're inside, follow the marker to exit B2. That should take you straight to City Hall. You could have told me this on my communicator, you know. Maybe so, but I couldn't have given you this. The passageways are still intact, but the collapse of Union has caused infrastructure issues. My communicator says that the gas leak is blocking the path to exit B2. You'd never make it through alive without this. Deadly gas leaks, huh? <laughs> Thanks for saving the worst for last, O'Neill. Based on what we've seen so far? I doubt that it's the worst you'll encounter. You're not helping. Anything else you need to know before you go? Wearing this is the only way to get through the gas-filled areas of the Mara. O'Neill was nice enough to find a brand new one for you, so you're not wearing a dead man's mask. Hooray! Chapter 4, Behind the Curtain. Alright, now, we've gotten pretty far in this episode, but we've got a... A little bit of time, especially because I'm going to edit out that bit. So what I'm going to do is we're just going to make our journey to that uh, north safe house, and then we will end it there. How's that sound, everybody? It's not that far of a journey, actually, especially when you consider that... Well, you know, I was just about to say, especially when you consider that I've killed almost everything in the town. It shouldn't take me more than a minute, I would say. If there's some stuff in the way, we'll deal with it as we get to it, but... Even with, I don't think that we're going to have much of an issue. Personally. I will say, probably uh, all those things outside the safe house over there that we were looking at before, but like nothing really happened with, that they were just on the ground and I was like, these are totally alive. Uh, those are totally alive now. I would uh, I'd bet my bottom dollar on it. Or if they're not alive, something there has taken the place. Whoa. Oh god, it's this thing again. Can it see me through bushes? It totally can. And it's still totally behind me. Oh, apparently it's got a distance break on its vision. I'm okay with it. All right, the ghost is gone. I mean, I, it totally got me able to clear that area pretty quickly. That Sounds seems. Like in trouble. Oh my god! No! Those things will kill her if I don't do something. Who? Where? Oh, in that house.
Damn us being a hero, right? Yeah. All right, that's one. At one out of four, right? Dead. Push it down. Take her stuff. No. Do I got any explosive bolts? I do. If they go over there like I would like them to, I could probably take out all three. They don't want to be friends and help me out. I'm going to go for it. I don't know if this guy's going to notice. Man, here I was thinking I was just going to take a quick little jog across the town. Here I am being a big damn hero again. Where's this dude at? Oh, he walked over there. Oh, just got into the bush in time. Alright, well, the one's dead. Oh! Shotgun. Going for two. Going for two. Now, that should have alerted everything in the town. This lady ain't even going to be alive. That's that's my guess here. All right, pistol, but change the type again. Go back to the semi-automatic. We're going for we're going for. It's okay, I took care of them. Please open the door. I need to ask you a few questions. She's dead. She's not even real. Oh shit! It's actually a living person. Are you okay, lady? Don't mind me. I'm going to rummage your house before I talk to you. Okay? We're gonna. I'm going to look at everything in here. And then I'm going to have a conversation with you. That's not weird, is it? I feel like that might be Thank weird. You. you saved me. I thought I was a goner for sure. It's okay. Calm down. What's going on out there? I'm the hero. How am I supposed to know? If anybody should be asking what's going on, it's me. Look, I just got here. I'm even more confused than you are. Oh, yeah? What's your name? It's Sebastian. Sebastian Castellanos. Well, then you're not as confused as I am. I can't even remember my own name. I don't know what day it is. I don't even know where I am. God, what's happening to me? Just. I wonder if she's real anything. or just a generation Wait of the minute. simulation. I was in that office being interviewed by that Asian doctor lady. The next thing I know, I'm in this town I've never been to, wearing clothes I've never seen, and there's this guy who says he's my husband telling me to run. I'm not married, mister. None of this is real. Can't be. I'm really sorry, but I want that crap behind you. Yeah. Come on, just nudge her out of the way. Come on. Come on. Let me ask you something. I'm looking for my daughter. She's six years old. Her name is Lily. I I haven't seen any kids out there. Nothing but those things. Okay, that's Damn fair. It. That's fair. Six years old? Oh, I'm sorry, mister. Poor thing. Being lost out there. Me too. But I'm not giving up until I find her. Yeah. So you just woke, woke up, up here, here a few right. hours ago? Hours, days, I can't figure time. The last thing I remember was being in that office, like I said. What office? I needed some money, so I answered an ad oh. for people to be in a sleep study. That sucks. She took my blood and gave me a physical, and then that Asian lady asked me weird questions all day, and I don't understand what's happening. Does the name Mobius mean anything to you? I don't think so, but I can't remember much of anything. Poor lady. All right, what about can those you things. Tell me about those things out there. I don't know. All I know is that they'll kill you if they get the chance. That is true. Stay away from them. Any idea where they came from? That guy who said he was my husband started acting all weird. He kept looking over his shoulder at something I couldn't see. Then all of a sudden, he's screaming and starts to change. Skin bubbling up. It was horrible. Next thing I knew, he was trying to kill me, too. So they used to be regular citizens. It's the What's ghost. Like when she sucks out your soul, you become one. I can't help you, mister. 
I'm gonna try to figure this out. Stay in here and keep the doors locked. It's not safe out there. I'm not going anywhere, that's for sure. But thanks for saving me. You need anything from the house? Let me ask you something. No, no, no. I do want stuff from the house. Good, you moved. Full on bullets. I'm totally full on bullets. Alright. Lady, you stay here. I'll come back for those bullets when I need them, alright? I'm gonna have to go kill some stuff, but I'll return. All right, now back to the main I issue. I more for her, but finding Lily is the best thing for everyone here. That's probably true. Now, there's no way I'm gonna be able to get past it, right? Like that's we've we've established this. I'm gonna give this the. Wow. <laughs> oh, baby, that was awesome. I get it. I get it. These things are all dead for the reason for that thing. So that it can scream and wake them all up. Uh-huh. I got you. But all right, we made it. All right. Probably should let Kidman know what's going on. Kidman, can you hear me? Loud and clear. What have you got for me? The good news is that I located O'Neill, and he was able to get me on the trail to find Lily. That's a good That's thing. Great. The bad news is that Union is literally falling apart around me, and it's mostly populated by corpses and monsters. Oh, and that psycho I told you about? The one with the powers he shouldn't have? Yes. He's got Lily. That guy sucks. Getting ready to head into the marrow, which you neglected to tell me about, to get to him. I'm sorry we didn't have time for a briefing before sending you in, but we didn't think it would be this bad. It's just as bad as Beacon in here. No, it's worse. My daughter wasn't stuck in Beacon. Okay, that is true. Calm down. Maybe I can help you out. Can you give me any information on this person? Male, about five foot ten, black hair. He fancies himself as some sort of artist. Blue suit. Not much to go on. Blue suit. Tell me something I don't know. I'm on my way to City Hall. I'll call you later. He likes photography. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. You could have been a lot more descriptive, dude. Like, honestly. Not a cop or nothing, but, you know, we've seen this guy like five times. Could have gone a little further into it. But, anywho. All right. So, that's going to be the end of this episode, folks. I'm going to double save because I just I get scared sometimes that I'm going to, like, log back in one day and it's not going to... I won't have a save file and I'll just start crying. Um, but that's going to be the end of this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. We've got a whole lot of good information going right here. The story is now moving forward. We're tracking Lily. We're going to the Marrow. Uh, pretty much, I guess, doing everything in this, this side of the city was useful beforehand before like going that far so i'm not too upset that i wasted like those episodes doing that so thanks everybody for watching if you like this episode please leave a like if you like this content please consider subscribing it's always appreciated tell your friends about my channel it's very very appreciated when you do that and hey if you guys want to pick a locker for me to open up with the next keys i find just let me know in the comments i just did that now and i just found some really awesome shotgun shells so thank you for that that was really good uh i don't know if you knew where those were but you definitely picked a winner uh, now I've got some spare sh shells on the back burn there, so I'm really excited about that. But as we delve further in, we're going after the, the photo photography photo photography guy. We're going to go after that dude, and we're going to mess him up, hopefully, and uh, get Lily back. So I'll see you guys next time.